when you're coding, you have to be very precise because it's exactly like a recipe. If you're baking a cake, then you have to tell the computer to co break open the egg, drop the two eggshells, and make sure the contents of the egg go into the bowl. Or it might just crack the egg, throw it in there, the eggshells are all spattered over there, and you wouldn't get a very good cake. <laughs> <laughs> this zombie here, he has to get to the sunflower, and I don't know if any of you have ever played Plants vs. Zombies. The zombies always try to get to the other side. And normally the sunflower is the last thing in the way. So, to move the zombie, you use commands like move forward, and then when you, dang this mouse is so hard, and then when you click run, he, see how he moved forward once? So then, if you add another move forward block, and then a move right block, it'll move forward two, and turn right, and that's exactly how you want to do it. But, you see, you have a workspace limit to use here, and I, I'm one away from the limit. So I can use the repeat number of times block, use the repeat number three, and then drag and drop my code here, and then drag and drop my code here, and then run this code, and it'll do these this string of code three times, which will... Move him to the sunflower. And then he wins. <laughs>